This is a great thing about Pilani. It's very flexible. You can make your own timetable. Grading is still tough. Asia's largest student-run cultural fest. So did you win something? We are currently making an electric go kart. And are you liking the hostels? In my own hostel, there are two common rooms. One is where you lay back and you know you can watch a movie with your friends. So if someone doesn't want to eat in mess, then what are the options? My wingies are absolutely awesome. That's where we play cricket till 4 a.m. or 3 a.m. at night. <laughs> 3 a.m. 4 a.m. Is it allowed? And that's the first thing that you do when you get to Pilani. Hi, my dear friends. So we have Samarth with us. He's a first year right at Pilani campus, and he's pursuing manufacturing engineering. As you know that the first year is very exciting year. It's like a roller coaster moment for everyone. And everyone wants to know what happens inside the college. So we are here to talk about the Pinani campus with the first year right himself. So Samarth, hi. Hi Aditya. So want to know a bit about your college experience and many things. So are you ready? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So first is how's your first year going on? It's going absolutely, you know, fine and everything maybe some things are not going as planned <laughs> but that i think that's to be expected it's the first year and everybody is getting settled in and, and it's going with the flow good good and are you liking the hostels oh yeah it has a vibe to itself like the architecture and especially the people the wing i mean my wingies are absolutely awesome what who are wingies by the way i mean you know okay i i have the bits and no wing you as a bitsy and no wing. People think wing means wing. But w what is wing? <laughs> okay, so wingies are basically all of my, uh, you know, my roommate, all of the people who live in the same wing, we call them wingies. They live in, uh, I mean, on the? On the same, in the same corridor. In basically. the same corridor. Yeah. Good, good. So, good to know. So, which bhavan you are in? I'm in Krishna bhavan. That's good, that's good. Uh, bhavan which is very much close to institute. Yeah, it's like... Uh, Usually, the rest of the bhavans, people need cycles to move around the entire campus. But with Krishna, I think walking uh, to all of the places, is, it's totally fine and manageable. So, I just want to know, how does your day look like from morning to evening? Okay, so Pila this is a great thing about Pilani. It's very flexible. You can make your own timetable. And that's the first thing that you do when you get to Pilani. And once you make your timetable, it, you can choose whether you want the tests, uh, the two tests which happen weekly on a weekly basis they can be announced unannounced you can choose to you know keep them in the morning if you wake up fresh and then you want to give those tests or you can keep those in the evening also that's great so for me specifically i wake up around eight o'clock i give those tests then the lectures are till one or twelve that depends again on p from a person to person basis and then uh, maybe if i if uh, there's a you know, group meeting with one of the clubs or anything that takes place uh, in the evening and that's it. You're free for the most of the day. So when you have talked about clubs, so I just want to know what are these clubs? Clubs and departments, they are quite famous in BITS campuses. So what are these? BITS has a variety of clubs. There are departments, there are associations, there are regional associations. So like, for example, I'm part of Udgam. It's a regional association of uh, people from the north, like Uttarakhand, Kashmir, etc., etc. So we go on treks, we plan those stuff out. There are uh, departments that take care of uh, prof shows, professional shows, as we call it. When people come from outside, speakers, TED speakers, singers, artists, we manage those. I'm also part of IKRG, Inspired Carter's Gravity. We are currently making an electric go-kart. So those kind of stuffs. A lot of uh, clubs and activities, uh, students coming to Bits Pilani can pick and choose on their own. They can form their own timetable and it's totally up to them. Oh, so that's so much flexibility. A lot. So which department or club you belong to? I belong to IKRG and then there's DVM, mm -hmm. Department of Visual Media. It takes uh, care of the trailers for uh, Oasis and uh, other fests that we have. And you told, uh, talked about one more department? IKRG, Inspired Carter's Gravity. What do they do? Okay, so I'm in the mechanical team of IKRG. I see. Basically, we are making an electric go-kart and we'll take, uh, you know, we'll take that go-kart to some competitions. And uh, so um, right now, they have given me certain tasks on Fusion 360, which I have to perform. 
and then uh, accordingly they will you know assign me a particular team maybe i can be in the steering team because i'm right now i'm uh, you know new to the club itself i'm a first year right that's why they're just uh, choosing what my skill sets would be most beneficial to them you just mentioned about something called oss yeah so want to know because you know it has been quite exciting moment for me when i was at bits pandarni so i want you to tell our viewers what is oss oss is awesome that's <laughs> one way to put it good it's like a 3 to 4 day fest and uh, you it's like 24 7 enjoyment that's it's a cultural a, festival yeah it's a cultural festival and uh, it's the la- asia's largest student run, uh, run tech uh, fest basically cultural festival yeah cultural fest Stu- asia's largest student run cultural fest so there are concerts there are shows you know you can uh, present you can take part in the fest uh, with your department with your organization you can explore lots of stuff to do basically good 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 to know so what did you do okay so i am also a part of the manufacturing association so we built a small track uh, we did an rc race competitions like that other than that i also bought a small camera from the photography club itself mm-hmm. and uh, used that to you know take photos of the entire uh, event and that w- it was basically a competition where you submitted those photos and then they'll, they'll rank you according to that okay so did you win something no <laughs> i'm terrible at taking photos okay no problem so are you a part of photo club no 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 i'm not but uh, i was you know inclined i was curious about what they were doing and they were giving out those cameras so i bought one good 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 so apart from cultural festival there are two more festival that happens actually there are three more three more yeah okay. there's the interbits which is like between bits pilani go and hyderabad okay. it's a sports fest there's uh there's called bossum it's uh, like the official sports fest like uh, people from other colleges can also come there bits open sports meet. yeah bits of open sports meet and there's apuji which is the tech fest the tech fest yeah so i think the bossum happens in first semester yeah bossum and uh, oss happens in first and the other two in the second semester okay okay good so now wish to know about the recreational activities what on recreational activities are there in pilani campus um in all of the hostels there are common rooms mm-hmm. my uh, in my own hostel there are two common rooms one is where you lay back and you know you can watch a movie with your friends or you know the cricket series that that keep on happening or f1 races whatever you want and Good. the other common room has a you know table tennis and uh mine has i i think they are uh, bringing a new pool table that's what the hostel representative <laughs> states in his agenda but who knows and uh, you know table tennis and some gym equipments as well so there's the student activity center we call sac okay. where you have your badminton courts you have mm-hmm. your um, dance club where mm-hmm. all of the rooms are assigned to different clubs you have your table tennis proper courts there and uh, we have student activity center and there's gym g gym g is like the grounds where you have the volleyball ground your football ground cricket ground and all of that so do you also go to play something i play football uh, you, usually we go late at night oh really yeah we do and uh, what we call as the qt of our uh, hostel that's where we play cricket till 4 am or 3 am at night that's awesome <laughs> 3 am 4 am is it an out yeah it is it is there's a lot of flexibility in pilani that's something i i don't think i'll see anywhere else it's like i should go once again now you've got more more flexibility yeah good 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 to know now we have talked about the schedule we have talked about recreational activities the most important thing is food so how is the food <laughs> food in mess okay so mess food is how do you would expect mess food to be <laughs> बट यू नो कभी कभार छोले भटूरे खाने के लिए तो सभी को जाना पड़ता है इडली सांबर एंड यू नो अनलिमिटेड एग्स एंड वॉट एवर यू वॉन्ट दिल प्रिपेयर इट फॉर यू दैट्स दैट्स ऑप्शंस ओके सो यू डोंट नीड टू गो आउट ऑफ द कैंपस फॉर दैट there's ank the all night canteen which is like open till 2 am 4 am 
there's like looters there what is that looters it's a new establishment basically you'll get uh, you know also all sorts of food there there's torts uh idli sambar everything like Good. all of your cravings will be satisfied here. <laughs> even the mess has its own dcc we call it. i don't know the full form for that but uh during tests and all you can just go there have a brownie with your friends and oh, enjoy it that's great yeah so it's not even you know very far from your bhavan you just you go out it's a 2 minute walk at max max and then you can have food and fill your bellies and maybe <laughs> hope that you study when you go back to your room good good and if someone wants to th- throw a party a birthday party uh, are there places yeah you go to looters i mean uh, everything is inside the campus you don't no- need to go outside the campus the campus is big it's well laid out it's beautiful there's a mandir saraswati temple it's very famous in palani yeah the nab which uh, which is newly made and the rotunda it's beautiful it's like a very scenic campus and how about the kanot place oh um kanot place is when you go there with your departments i see and usually when you you have prof talks and professors you want to meet your professor that's when you go to kanot and if you want to buy some stuff there's akshay the supermarket or you go to kanot get some print outs or stuff like that i see good 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 so now i want to know we talked many things apart from something which pinani is known for yeah. engineering so now i want to know how is the academic pressure uh since it's to completely student run so i wouldn't call it academic pressure but others do push you so you know they try you try to extend your limits but on your own hmm because everything is laid out for you because everything is in your hands nobody is going to come forth and tell you that you should do this or do that they will guide you but it's up to you so yeah correct correct i when i used to be in pinani campus we used to have very very tough grading how about your grading grading is still tough they'll not let you go easy here okay but that's what you should be mentally prepared for if you're coming to a uh, campus where everybody is will be of high iq where everybody would be ready to push their limits yeah. they'll expect the same from you yeah i mean all on toppers from india they all they, over they, india they, they, yeah they come so it becomes quite tough to to manage but yeah i understand what you're saying now talking about your specific branch which is manufacturing yes why did you choose manufacturing branch over other because india is like the you know the go to place for manufacturing countries all over are coming to india for their manufacturing reach like you know and this is one area where the growth the potential for growth is basically unlimited that's why i chose manufacturing plus i wanted to go into core and uh, all of the courses kids you need to check the courses first <laughs> don't go blindly for the branch so you need to check all the courses and though all of those aligned with my needs and my you know uh i thought that my capabilities will be successful uh, in these particular courses and i'll be good in these so that's why i chose manufacturing now b- because this is a new branch yeah manufacturing is a new branch i wish to know what are the opportunities the internship opportunities placement opportunities the uh, uh placement opportunities internship opportunities are plenty in core um, you get most of them from the mechanical branch itself you can go into finance finance is something that uh, every bra- uh, companies uh, don't specify which branch they need correct and if you are good in it and cs again that's something that companies don't look uh, other than some specific companies who uh, go for only eco and uh, cs uh, i don't think there's any you know uh, you don't need to be in a specific branch basically uh, it's basically you get to choose your own co- uh, in pilani like you you need to complete your uh, units basically mm-hmm. so uh, you can choose and pick up co- electives from other branches as well from your own branch discipline <laughs> electives hum- uh, humanities electives correct. so you can mix and match correct correct what are these electives by the way okay so these are in uh, pilani we have a system of units and uh, to graduate you need to have a set amount of units correct okay so if uh, if suppose i am interested in a particular subject even though i am in the manufacturing branch but i want to study an elective uh, but study a subject which is related to say uh, cs mm-hmm. i can choose an elective from cs other than doing electives from my own branch as well which are compulsory you can choose and pick from other branches as really? well yeah good 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 and these humanities subject are are subjects are also there right yeah 
so you can choose that also yeah that you know again you can pick and choose i don't have the list right now but you can pick and choose i see i see so samarth now this is a personal question uh what are your future plans okay so i am very much inclined towards design okay i want to do design specifically automobile design so that's why i uh, after doing my btech at um, be uh, manufacturing at uh, bits pilani pilani campus i would want to do an ma master of arts from maybe a prestigious university like you know royal college of arts in london or pasadena so yeah that's something that i'm really looking forward to right now good good so thanks for your time samarth thank you aditya uh, you know thank you so much so dear friends so hope you have got you know so much insight from the pilani campus and uh, if you have any other question you can put in the comments below we'll be able to answer them thank you so much for watching this podcast